Good morning from Bella Houston Park. Felt like being amidst the trees today. and I'm in the middle of a beautiful tree line actually here. The little play park. Oh, plug in my eye. Uh, there at the end, which is lovely. And uh, this is one of the many parks that live that live that I live near. Um, so I took a wee run down the way, so a mile probably. It's probably about the same distance um, here to the Brimble, I should think. Maybe, maybe a bit shorter actually, and it's a nicer, it's a nicer run because um, the route between my house and the Brumalaw is very pedestrian unfriendly, uh, which is unfortunate because it's not that far away. The river is about a mile and a half. This is probably just under a mile, I should think. And um, yeah, I, uh, last time, of course, I podcasted, I was having grumpy day. And you know, grumpy days are totally acceptable. I think, you know, when you have any emotion, this is sometimes your only indicator of what's going on in your life. And I think my grumpiness is very indicative of the fact that I was tired, you know. It's like little kids, they, they get, when they're tired, they need to be put into bed, they need to be fed, <laughs> you know, all these things. They get grumpy. And I have had, you know, a quite exhausting past few months and um, probably looking forward thinking, right, um, don't know how I'm going to, uh, what, how the rest of it's gonna pan out because um, yesterday was my last confirmed day of work. Um, although I've got some other stuff that is probably happening um, in the next couple of months and uh, many other things that I'm waiting to hear on. I have a, a meeting with Cultural Enterprise on the phone today and another one with them later in the month about a couple of things um, so that could be really good so keeping on keeping on but it, it's tiring and it's one of these funny contradictions because of course technically i guess i have time although i'm, I'm constantly busy because i'm constantly trying to generate work and keep and not only that but like keep myself fit because a big part of what i do is my dancing and, and so if i'm not dancing regularly i get out of shape not to mention the fact that i, I need it mentally and all this other stuff so you know, like, um, so probably what would be really beneficial for me would be like a holiday on a beach somewhere. But of course, that's not that's not a possibility for me right now because I don't have uh, the resources to do that, uh, which is the way it is. So I need to uh, find other ways to take care of myself and to nurture myself and take time out. Um, so. You know, it's like I think I, I, I tweeted on the other day, I just sat on the sofa and I watched, um, actually ended up watching Eat, Pray, Love, which of course made me long for travel more because in that film she goes to Italy, uh, uh, and India and Bali. Uh, um, but you know, hey ho, uh, those, those times will come. So I felt, uh, so yesterday was Ready, Steady, Grow and I was the green fairy and absolutely had a blast uh, building. I love making costumes, as you probably can tell if you've seen the pictures. Um, I just have such, uh, such a good time pulling all that together. And uh, so that was really good. And, and I love, you know, the whole community spirit of that and everything. Um, and so today I just thought, you know what, I just, I quite fancy quite a quiet meditative dance and I essentially outside of one or two dog walkers and one old guy he stopped and watched me for quite a while um, I'm here by myself and and I like that today actually just me and, and mom and Natura and the trees and I find it, nature so deeply comforting and I'm so fortunate that um, and that's probably a big part of me trying to you know satisfying that grumpy side of me I'm not grumpy anymore um, but just that whole thing about being near nature is, is she's such a solve, salve, salve, she just solve things, salve to, to you. So spending time um, in nature is, is a wonderful thing and, and reconnects you to the cycle of life and reminds you um, that nothing is permanent. So, so yeah, so lovely, but I, 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 I was really having a lovely, very relaxing, very graceful dance today, uh, really in the zone as it were but in, in a really lovely calm way and uh and i have to go because i've got i've got things going on and i'm planning dance piece <laughs> my 24-hour dance a thon and 
yeah so that, that's the plan for the day so i don't know when i'll be back at the room law i love the room law but it's funny because this time of year this happened last year as well i think it's something about the summer and the trees and things like that because it's quite a desolate space down there and it does get very hot believe it or not um, when it's a bit warm out because of the water and the stone and um and so the energy just does does really change come June. Um, but I feel like, you know, I've got this community down there, so I have to figure out how, how I can transform that practice as well, at least to maintain that connection, maybe go down once a week or, or something like that, uh, and manage to get myself out of bed in time to be down there, you know, by eight, because that's the other thing. You know, and I think when I had the sunrise thing, it was a contained thing, and I had a very strategic, um, set like kind of like right okay I have to do this and have to stick to this so I was very disciplined I am very disciplined about dancing but I don't the time thing has ceased to have any meaning for me uh, and so uh, which is what it is um, but it would be nice I feel like I owe it I don't owe it but I feel like I really want all those people that I was used to seeing before nine o'clock before 8 30 at eight o'clock I haven't seen for ages and 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 I, and I liked that actually so um, my voice is a bit hoarse this morning <laughs> good morning everyone <laughs> anyway so that's that's the story for today um, I hope you have a great rest of your day and wherever I am tomorrow I will see the, the e-waves true bye